Ah, another day to tend to my melon patches. Oh, I can't. Ah, what the heck was that? Lightning just struck my melon patch. Wait, why is there armor and a sword? Heck, God sword and God armor? What the heck? This thing is insane. Plus 1,024 armor? Bro, I'm practically invincible. Shuddy, get down here right now. Bro, what's the big idea? I'm trying to play my game. Sonny, I've got to show you this. Trust me. Ah, fine. I just put it on pause. I'm coming downstairs. What's the deal, bro? You're freaking out over nothing. Bro, do you see the armor I have on? It was so random. Lightning struck right here, and then suddenly, an entire set of god armor appeared. Bro, that just looks like old iron armor. <gasps> but that sword is insane! Yeah, bro. Check it out. Ow! How'd it kill me in one hit? Bro, it does one million and two attack damage. Ugh, <sighs> Melon, that's great and all, but don't kill me with it. Plus, give me half of that armor. I want some. No way I'm giving you any of this armor, Sonny. It appeared on my watermelons, which makes it mine. Yeah, you're telling me you were just looking at the Wanders and then out of nowhere, lightning struck. Yeah, dude, I'm telling you. It just hit right here on this melon patch. What the heck? It just happened again. Let's go. I got my own setup now. Oh my goodness, you're right. This armor is insane and the sword is busted sonny you know what this means right we have all the power now we could control the entire village and make them do whatever we want starting with quandale let's do this thing hello quandale ha nice armor bozos you look like dorks we look like dorks quandale we're invincible so you're gonna give us every single doohickey you have in this lab otherwise you're gonna die along with your experiments like this sheep say goodbye to him quandale or cough up some doohickeys okay okay just don't hurt me or my sheep and also quandale you have to do everything we say yes that part is very important Important. Starting with this, I'm taking every single one of your emeralds. Oh, even better than doohickeys. We're rich. Let's head to Target, Sonny. We've got some money to spend. Not that we need to spend it, though. That's right. We could pretty much make Steve give us everything for free. Yes, with great power comes great responsibility. So, uh, Melon, how can we always go crazy with power? Probably because we're very irresponsible, but that doesn't matter. Steve! It's time. You better give us everything in your shop for free. Yeah. And you better give us some emeralds while you're at it, too. Wait, where are my emeralds going? His shop just absorbed them. Give me them back. What the? Did you take my emeralds, Melon? Probably. What's going on with my emeralds? Oh, there we go. We'll take that. Anyways, Steve, give us everything. I won't give you anything for free. If I do, I'll ruin my business. Do you care more about your business or your life, Steve? That's right. You won't have to worry much about this shop if we kill you and every other stinking villager. <laughs> Don't make me hit him. Don't make me. Fine, take whatever you want. Eh, actually, I'm good. I don't really want anything, Steve. Nah, I wanted some epic bacon. I'm taking it all. It's mine now. Well, Sonny, that was fun threatening and intimidating Steve. <sighs> what should we do now? Whoa, Melanie and Sunshine. Where'd you get that cool armor? And Melon, I wouldn't mess with them. It looks like they also have god swords. You guys are too arrogant. We too got god armor. So we're gonna have a competition on who can keep the armor. Bruh, they want to compete to see who's gonna run the town? Sunshine, I think that's a great idea. I want to team up with you so that we can control Melon <laughs> and tell Melanie what to do as well. I made the challenges, so we'll definitely win. Let's go. It's okay, Melanie. We'll team up. You have the most courageous fighting spirit I've ever known. So what's the first challenge? It's parkour. Whoever completes the fastest wins. <gasps> this obby looks awesome. It sure does. It sure does. Start the timer now. Dang it. I knew you would pull some stunt like that. Whatever. I can still... Oh, that's a bad start. Um, as I was saying, I can still win! No, you can't, Sonny. It's over for you. All over. I need some epic bacon. Ah, oh, I was hoping that would make me run faster. Check it out. I actually have such a huge lead right now. But I need some momentum if I want to clear this jump. Dude, I keep messing these jumps up. This is bad! Okay, I'm just gonna build the momentum and make it! Oh, that was a close one. Psst. Psst, sunshine, I need a swiftness potion, please. Wow, Sunny, you're pretty bad at this. 
Here you go. Thank you. That'll do the trick. Hey, no fair. Well, you should have helped Melon out yourself then. Gotta go. Please, I got a minute and a half where I run super fast. I gotta catch up to Melon while I can. Take my time here. Slow and steady wins the race. Yeah, slow and steady, Melon. You do that. Oh, 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 oh. I'm zooming. I'm actually zooming. Let's go. Hey, Melon, I unlocked the checkpoint for us. Hurry up, Slowpoke. Shut up. Up, Sonny, how did you catch up so fast? Uh, no reason. Whatever, you're gonna mess up at some point here. Nah, I never mess up. I am the goat with the sauce. Ooh, ooh, I'm crushing this. Let's go. I might be the best who's ever parkoured. Oh, that was bad timing. I will catch up. Oh, wait, wait, did you fall? Yeah. Let's go. That means the melon's in the lead. Dang it. That was embarrassing. Now, I'm at the Red Wolf stage. Oh, that was close. I almost messed it up big time. But here we go. Sonny, I'm almost at the end, which means I'm going to win. Yeah! Oh, I made it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You think you're going to win? I could still catch up. There's still a chance. Oh, that's sad. That is just sad. Did you fall again? No. Oh, definitely not. Okay, I'm gonna need some momentum here. Momentum. Momentum! Oh, that was close. But I'm so close to the end. I just can't afford to mess up. Dang it. He's at the end of the wool. But maybe the lava over there will burn him. Okay, gotta use the momentum on the ice to jump all the way. Okay, I'm actually doing it right now. I'm at the nether rack. Dang it. I gotta catch up to him before he finishes. It's so close. Just don't fail this jump again. It'd be really sad. And so sand. The last three pieces of the park. Car. Come on. Yes. I'm onto the colorful wool melon. Where are you at, bro? Uh, crushing you right now. Sonny, I can't even see you. You're so far behind. No way. I see you over there. You just got through the netherrack cave. Dang it. I gotta go a little bit quicker, but I don't want to slip. I hate this. <laughs> Sonny, you suck. All I've got to do is these last few jumps. Here we go. Ice accomplished. And let me just punch this flame out real quick. This one too. And this one as well. I don't even care if it's cheating. I win! No way you just finished it! Dang it! Wait a second. Maybe uh, if I finish in the next two seconds, it's a draw, huh? How about that? Oh, no. Well, Sonny, it's not a draw. I win! On to round two. Okay, welcome to round two. Whoever kills the most monsters wins. Wait, wait, wait. What do you mean, monsters? Ah! Take them out! Oh, oh, these are my kills! These are my kills! Let's go! Wait, no. I gotta kill these mutant zombies here. It's the only way. Come on, get back up, get back up. First hit's mine! Uh, well, I at least killed one of the zombies. They're not even dead yet, bro. Oh, oh! Well, Sonny, I'll give it to you. You killed two of the zombies, but I got one of them. How many skellies did you get? All three. No, I killed one of them. Okay, fine. Then I killed two of each. You killed one of each. Which makes me the winner! Let's go! You suck a PvP! Yeah, I don't think this is a fair contest, Sonny. Hey, chill! Yeah, it looks like my dear Sonny won after all. Thanks, Sunshine! I knew I got the Dubberton. Anyways, now that the challenges are tied up one-to-one, -one, what's gonna be the tiebreaker? Okay, for a tiebreaker, you guys have to go and stop Dr. Longbottoms. Whoever stops his evil plan first wins. You hear that, Melon? We just have to stop Dr. Longbottoms. Yeah, exactly. That's why I I'm out of here! Whoa, 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 whoa. How are you getting out of here? I was hoping this was like Thor's hammer and I could use it to fly. Oh, yeah. Girls, can you just teleport us close to Longbottoms and then we'll find him? Yeah, no problem. Wait, we're back at the village. That means Dr. Longbottoms gotta be in the town somewhere. That sneaky dude. Yeah, and I can smell him. <laughs> the stench of Longbottoms is strong. Somewhere over here, I think he took over Quandale's old lab. Yeah, that's stupid. I'm gonna go check. Where's the place I'd least expect? Oh, our very own house. Yeah, yeah, you check the house. I'm breaking in here. Long bottoms. I know you're around here somewhere. Show yourself! Aw, oh, he's not in here. Long bottoms. I know you're up here. Or actually, better yet, I know you're downstairs beneath the house in a secret lair. Aren't you? Where are you, long bottoms? Okay, he's not here. Wait a second. I think he's just outside of town. The girls did this just to troll us. He's over here. The stench of Dr. Longbottoms. I'd recognize it anywhere. There he is! I actually found him! And now I simply need to kidnap him as proof that I defeated 
defeated his next evil plot. I bet you Longbottoms is at Sunshine's workshop. That's probably where they're hiding him. That's it, Longbottoms. It's time for me to- No way, Melon! How did you get here? <sighs> I've been running around town for the past hour, and you found Dr. Longbottoms? Yeah, I was about to confront him about his evil plans and then kidnap him, so I had evidence that I won the challenge. Well, I guess we found him at the same time. Um, guys, this is my day off. I just want to fish. Nah, no time for fishing. You're coming with me. Sonia, I think you killed him. Nah, I knocked him out, look, see? But I need to get him out of the water quick before he drowns! As you can see, I successfully kidnapped Dr. Longbottoms. I was there too! All Sonny did was hit him with a sword. Yeah, kind of like this. No, please don't! <laughs> see? Well, we'll call this round a tie. The last challenge will decide. Sonny versus Melon PvP battle. No way. A PvP battle? You're going down! Down. No, you're going down. Wait a second, we're just back in the same arena. Yeah, and how is this gonna work? We just one-shot each other. Well, you have three lives. The first person to lose all three lives, well, loses. That makes sense. Die, Melon! No, you die, Sonny. No, I don't want to die. And you're scared of me, clearly. Yeah, I got my back towards you. Oh, you thought! Oh, you thought! How about this? Eat my bum! Ow. The bum has been eaten. And that means you have two lives left. Left. Whatever. Quit being so sus and just die! No! Dang it. It's one to one. No mercy! Oh, we traded! Did you die too? Yeah, bro. That was awesome. Final battle. Who will win? Return the gear you have stolen or die by my hand. Wait a second. The gear we stole? You're Zeus, the god of thunder! Are you telling me you accidentally threw your gear down from Olympus? Yeah, but it was an accident, all right. Now, are you gonna give it up? Because I'm gonna kill you if you don't. Melon, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha! God of thunder my butt! That was easy! Dude, we just killed an actual god! Yes, we need to remember, Melon, if we work together with this gear, we're literal gods ourselves! We don't have to listen to Sunshine and Melanie anymore! We can make them do whatever we ask! Oh, shut up. You aren't that strong. Melanie, let's show them what we're made of. Uh, Sonny, let's take him out. Ow, I'm dead. I just took out Melanie, which makes me the only god. Oh, wait, no, they respawned. Uh, goats, please, please like it. Yeah, goats, like and subscribe. Because we just lost our god gear. They literally broke our armor. So all we have left now to defend ourselves is you. Press the like button to support us. And subscribe if you're new around here to get goaded. This is Minecraft, but I can never die. My crazy fangirl tricked me into drinking an immortality potion. But if I don't find a way to die in the next 12 hours, I'll fall in love with her forever. Now, I've got to find a way to do the impossible. Do you guys want to become immortal? Press that subscribe button and you'll forever be alive as our subscribers. Ah, another day of just farming up some melons. In a humane way, of course. Oh, Melody's calling me. I wonder what she wants. Oh, hey, baby. What's my melon poo doing? It's been a while since you called me, Melanie. Well, not really doing much. What are you up to right now? Oh, sweetie, I could listen to you all day. Tell you what, why don't you come over to Melanie's house? <laughs> oh, I'd love to. That would be so much fun. But why would you call it Melanie's house? And wouldn't you just say your house? It was a joke, silly. Come on over. I have a big surprise for you. Oh, I'm so giddy. I can't wait to see Melanie. Oh, Melanie. Melanie, where are you? I'm over here. Melanie, I can't wait to see. What the heck? What did you just do to me? Melonia, what did you do with Melody? What's going on? Oh, Melon, dear, you came right away. You're so sweet. I didn't wait longer than two minutes. That's why Melanie called me? Wait, you were impersonating Melanie. No, where is she? Actually, no, more importantly, what did you just hit me with? Was that a potion? What are you scheming, Melonia? I like it when you're all worked up and angry. Answer me! Fine, geez, that potion gave you immortality. Now no one can hurt my big, strong Melon. Really? Uh, are you sure that's it? I was expecting something four times worse, like a love potion or something. Actually, thank you, Melonia. Anyways, I'll be leaving now. Well, it has a slight side effect, but it's a good one. Oh, I knew it was too good to be true. If you don't die in the next 12 hours, then you'll fall in love with me. Permanently. What is wrong with you, Melonia? <laughs> Sorry, sweetie, I don't just want to leave you alone right now, but... Wait, you're leaving? I need to go prepare my things because I'll be moving in. See ya. Dang it, she just left me. Oh, man, how am I gonna die? I'm literally immortal. Bro, I'm cooked. 
cooked. I don't want to fall in love with Melonia. Melon, over here. Melanie, Melanie, I can hear you. What's going on? No, she captured you and put you down here. Please help me, Melon. Here, let me help you out, Melanie. Oh, thank goodness you're okay, Melanie. Melanie, we've got really, really bad news. What's that? Well, pretty much, I'm immortal now. That sounds like good news. But, but if I don't die in the next 12 hours, I'll fall in love with Melonia forever. Only 12 hours? But wait, I saw an online show where contestants were competing to die. You should totally enter that. Uh, I don't know. Just trust me, they die hundreds of times on that show. Go check it out on my PC. All right, Melanie, I guess it's worth a shot. I mean, I'm pretty much cooked at this point anyways. Let's see, what is this show about? Hello, everyone. Welcome to Six Ways to Die. In this show, contestants are competing to die. For each time you die, you get a stack of emeralds. But wait, I have two questions, Jessica. Oh, Patrick, didn't see you there. Ask away. How do I sign in? Through our website, of course. Now shown on screen. What was the second question? Why are you here? I thought Sarah was the main show host in Block Village. Can we get her? Wow, that's so rude. Anyways, dear viewers, go sign up now. Wow, Melanie, did you hear that? Yeah, where is Sarah? I really like her. Don't tell me she quit her job. No, Melanie, who cares about Sarah right now? I'm talking about the show. I'll be able to die and I'll get rich out of it. This is a win-win situation. A win-win-win. Win situation, actually. An additional win, since I won't fall in love with Melonia. Anyways, I gotta go. I don't have a whole lot of time. I've gotta enter the competition as soon as possible. Get me on my PC right now. But, um, first, let's see if I really can die. hey -ya! Time to drown myself. I literally can't drown. Are you kidding me? All right, if I can't drown myself, let's see if I can take some fall damage. hey -ya! All right, this thing is legit. I'm actually invincible. I gotta sign up right now. Maybe there's some creative way they can kill me. All right, and boom. Looks like I've signed up for the show. No way. I'm already getting a call. Hello, is this big man Melon? Yes, it is. Congratulations, Melon. You're in the show. That whole can't die story will fit perfectly with our show. It will build up a lot of suspense. Yeah, I also have some crazy fangirl. If I don't die in the next 12 hours, I'll fall in love with her forever. Wow, even more drama? That's what we need. Come over immediately. I'm already on my way. I need to die. All right, Melon. You may begin the first challenge. Uh. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, I think it's gonna take more than this to kill me, but I guess it's worth a try. Yep, not even close. Took zero damage, and I'm not getting burnt at all. You guys are gonna have to do better than this if you wanna kill me. Since you can't die with fire, why not try finding a button with a command that will inflict you 100 hearts of damage? Good luck. Alright, I need to find the button to this command block, and when I press it, I'll die! Because it's a command block. Surely that'll kill me. Okay, just gotta look around. Where is this button? Usually they hide these buttons up real high. So I'm gonna check up top here, and I'm seeing a command block, and I already found the button. Bro, it literally does nothing! Are you kidding me? Maybe there's another button around here somewhere. Button, 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 where are you? Oh, maybe in this cave? There's gotta be another one. There's nothing in here. Holly G. Wait a second. There's another button right here. This has gotta be it. It's time to die! And it did nothing again. Jessica, bring me to the next room. The next room is the raid button room. Choose the correct button to make the raid mobs attack you. Oh my goodness, another button room. We've been over this, it's not gonna work. You could spawn in 18 withers and five wardens and I still wouldn't die. Come on, it's gotta be one of these buttons around here. Maybe the wall buttons. Hey, that one works. If I just keep spamming this, more raid mobs will come in. These guys only have weak bows, so that's not strong enough. Come on, it's gotta be something else around here. Not even taking any damage. Uh, they got a big dog here. Is it gonna work? Nope. Still doing no damage. And I have a feeling it's just all four corners. Look, you really think this witch is gonna be able to do anything to me? Alright, final corner. Yeah, your mobs aren't working. If anything, they're just super annoying. I haven't even taken half a heart of damage yet. I'm running out of time here. The 12 hours is almost up. If I don't die soon, I'll love Melonia forever. Jessica, take me to the next challenge. Man, I really took a lot of arrows that time. Not even a single heart. Well, I have a feeling this room won't kill you either, but we have to use it. It's in the budget. Uh, what do I do? Turn all these pigs into zombie pigmen and then attack them. Really? This is not gonna work. Uh, I'll give it a shot, though. Follow me, piggies. Oh, yeah, you wanna carry it. You wanna carry it, I know. Come in here. There we go. I turned them all into zombie pigmen. And boom! Oh, no, they're all mad at me! Oh, no! Yeah, psych. They can't even do any damage to me. I'm literally invincible. Take me to the next challenge already. 
already. Now this is looking a little more promising. Some lava. You know, I have a strange feeling I won't die, but it's worth a shot. Yep, I am also fire resistant. Of course. Whatever. I might as well explore this lava slide. Maybe they have something for me. Come on, is there anything else over here? Whoa, looks like there's another section to this room. It says go. All right, well, I guess I'll step on this. Do you want to die? Yes, I do want to die. That is the whole point of this. So kill me! Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure I want to die. Please, please take my life already. I don't have a lot of time. But are you sure? sure? How many times do I have to confirm this? Yes, I want to die. And it's a prank. Are you kidding me? Just take me to the next room, Jessica. You guys suck. Huh, Melon got trolled by our traditional prank here on six ways to die. Let's move on to the next room, shall we? This room? This room might actually be able to do it. It looks spooky. It looks ominous. Maybe you could do some kind of ritual to kill me. Nope, this one is simple. Collect as many heads and skulls as possible and advance to the next room. From there, you'll get the rest. <sighs> Dang it. I've got a feeling I'm not gonna die. Actually, I'm gathering wither skeleton skulls. Maybe if I summon a wither in the next room, that could actually kill me. It's one of the most powerful mobs in Minecraft. Need to collect every single head here. I've almost got them all. And what is in this chest? Chemical X and soul sand. Oh, I'm gonna be summoning some really powerful mobs. If this can't kill me, nothing can. I don't really know how this Chemical X stuff works, but I have a feeling if I do this and throw some Chemical X on it, um, nothing's happening. I take it back. What the heck? They all spawned in. Wait, fight me. Don't fight each other. Take me out, please. There was a second there where they actually hurt me. Dang it. That's it. Oh my goodness. I might actually die. It's the mutant zombies. They have the power to kill me. Please kill me, mutant zombie. Just smash me for the one time. Oh, that sounded a little sus. Dang it. He died. How am I supposed to die now? The only thing in this game that could kill me was those mutant zombies. But I wasted all of my chemical X. But maybe a wither could do the trick. Can you guys stop? I'm trying to spawn in something here. Yes. Maybe it's explosion. Please. Please destroy me. Come on. Come on. And it did nothing. And I'm still taking zero damage. Damage. That's it. I give up. Take me to the next room, Jessica. Cut myself down to one and a half hearts, but I still can't die. For this next challenge, you'll need to find the most dangerous ingredients for the world's deadliest cake. Wow, scary. That's it, Jessica. Obviously, this cake is not gonna kill me. That's it. I have no choice. I have to call the one person that I know could take me out. Pumpkin. Hello? Pumpkin? Melon bro, is that actually you? What do I owe this, um... Uh, Unexpected pleasure? No, that's not it. Listen here, Pumpkin. Since you're not in the mood like always, I'll cut the small talk. I need a favor. Oh, and what makes you think I want to help you? Is it because since we're such close brothers and we get along so well? Well, Pumpkin, I did actually invite you that one time for Christmas. And you kind of always just start things. I start things? Oh, I oughta. Well, you did invite me that one time for Christmas. Tell you what, brother. Since you managed to pique my interest, I'll help you with whatever you want. But I want something in return. I need you to kill me. I can't die. But I need to die. Pumpkin, I can't live on like this. I get to kill you and I get a favor? This is like a dream come true. You do it or not? Oh, I can do it. Melon, is everything okay? That cake isn't going to bake itself, you know. Shut up, I'm out of here. This game show can't kill me. Only Pumpkin can. All right, Melon, I'll kill you now, but I need to use my favor to kill you. Oh, okay, uh, well, what is it? I need your death ray block. I know you have it in your basement. That'll destroy all of Block Village. Yeah, that's part of my favor. Fine, fine. We'll just rebuild the village after anyways. If I'm stuck in love with Melonia, there's no fixing that. Here you go, I've got the death ray block. You want me to light it up? Yeah. This better work, Pumpkin. Oh, it will. All right. Hit me with your beam of destruction. Please. I need to die. Um, Pumpkin, are you kidding me? It didn't even work. <laughs> I knew that wouldn't kill you. Pumpkin, I'm going to be in love with Melodia forever. You scumbag. Don't worry. I'm a man of my word. Wait. Is that a god sword? Yeah! Goats, he did it. He actually... Oh, no. Oh, I survived somehow. But he actually killed me, which means I'm free of the curse. So please, subscribe right now. This is Minecraft, but we can't die. No matter what we try to do, we can never end this nightmare. Please subscribe right now so we can free ourselves from this curse. No, no, no. Sonny, I need your help. Bro, why do you always disturb me? I'm trying to enjoy my weekend. Okay, Sonny, don't be mad. But this witch cursed me and now I can't die. Why is that a problem, dude? That sounds like a blessing. Because if I don't 
don't die in the next 24 hours, I'll lose my Minecraft. It'll get deleted, bro. That's great news. Then I can play Minecraft by myself without you. Let's go. Oh, and one more thing, Sonny. Uh, the effect's on you now, too. What the heck, bro? So I gotta die as well or my Minecraft gets deleted? Yeah, bro. We're in it together. Okay, we have 24 hours, Melon. We have to figure this out. Thanks a lot. Wait, after you threw that potion on me, I could... What the heck? I can break glass with my face? Yo, this is kind of awesome. Yo, what the heck? That's so weird. I guess it's so if you glitch into like a half block, you can't die from it. <laughs> That's funky. So, Melon, if we've got to die, do you have any wise ideas? Yeah, I do. Die! Yeah, you die! Let's go! Come on, bring it on, Melon. What you got? Look at this wombo combo. Wombo combo. Wombo combo. Wombo combo. Wait, Melon. I got a delivery for Big Man Melon. You ordered pizza? What the heck is going on? What are these messages? Melon, I didn't know you ordered pizza. Did you get some for me? No, bro. I ain't get nothing for you, bro. I don't think this is working. You ain't get none of this long, Johnson. Uh, wait, I mean, pizza. Uh, what? Never mind. Grab that. Pause, sus. That was sus, and you need to chill. Listen, Melon, this isn't working. We need to think of a better idea. Stop hitting me. This is just annoying. Okay, okay, Sonny. I've got a good idea. Let's build a gigantic tower and jump Ooh, off. I've got a better idea. There's already a gigantic tower. Let's just climb to the top. Yo, follow me, Sonny. Wait, do you know which place to go? Yeah, in here, and then in here, up the stairs, and now we just go winding up this staircase all the way to the rooftop. Bruh, this is gonna go on forever. This is why I use the elevator. Well, the elevator broke, okay? It's under maintenance right now. Just get to the top floor and wait for me, and we'll jump off together and die and break this curse. It's gonna be glorious. Bruh, what the heck? This might be the first time ever that dying saves Minecraft. Let me out! Oh my god, doors are not my strong suit. <laughs> okay, okay, Melon. Are you ready, bro? Yeah, I'm ready. Wait, you can just walk into these things? All right, you ready, Sonny? Three, two, one, bro. <laughs> I got feather falling on me. I literally can't die. Wait, what? Also, Melon, why do we have a fire helmet on our heads? What the heck? I took it off. I took it off. Wait, maybe that means I can burn myself. Melon, find me a flint and steel or some lava. Quick. Okay, okay. Um, uh, maybe there's lava here? Over here at the portal. Come on. Yo, there's lava. Get in there. It's doing nothing. This stupid fire helmet keeps respawning on my head. Bro, what the heck is this? It's an iron ingot. Yo, I'm farming up iron. Get this nugget off of me. Yo, I'm farming. I'm farming iron. Oh, wait. Yo, Melon, keep going. Keep going. Give me these fire helmets. Oh, wait. They just deleted themselves. I have nine. Oh, wait. I have eight of them. Let's freaking go. No, I can't even die here. What is it giving me? You look like a mess, bro. You've got hell and flames and smoke and all kinds of stuff. Oh, wait, you're normal again. Bro, it makes me levitate over the fire block. What? Dude, you can't even stand on these. Hold up. That's crazy. You're right. Sonny, we've got to think of some better ideas. Melon, I've got an idea. Make more iron nuggets. We're going to build an anvil. Yo, that's actually smart. Okay, okay. Farm them. Farm them faster. This is gonna take forever. Do you know how much iron an anvil costs? Do you see how fast I'm dropping these? Bro, how are you doing that? How are you doing that? I'm the goat. That's how. I'm spamming Q. Come on. Let's see how many I got now. And yeah, I think I've got enough for an anvil. <laughs> I don't think you do. Maybe not yet. But if you click faster, we'll have enough. Ugh. Melon, I think I have enough. Let's go. How many do you have, Sonny? Stacks upon stacks upon stacks. I got nine stacks. Bro, we just deleted my thing. No. Wait, what? No, dude. As soon as we were too slow, we needed to craft faster. Okay, I've got an idea. No, just don't jump in the water. It deleted it because it gave you a water ring. Are you kidding me? Well, back to farming, Sonny. Let's try this again. I'm making a workbench and I'm putting the workbench right here and I'm gonna farm these fire helmets and then instantly craft them. Melon, don't leave the fire. Craft from inside of it. And then we take all of these nuggets. Do I even have enough? Bro, I, I'm actually farming so quick right now, Sonny. Yeah? Yo, Melon, I have so many fire helmet iron ingots. This was so smart. I think I have enough. Yeah, dude, we could definitely make an anvil. Are you sure? Yeah, I have enough. And it's like this and like that. I got an anvil, bro. Wait, I want to make my own anvil, please. We are geniuses. As long as it doesn't magically delete this now, please keep my anvil in my inventory. Is it? How do you even make an anvil again? Oh, you trash. I don't got enough. Whatever. I'm just, I'm going to use your anvil, all right, bro? That's fine. You will. I'm going to drop it on your head. Yeah. Oh, I just deleted my ironing. Yo. Hey, chill. Hey, chill. Okay, Melon, I need you to stand right here, okay? Okay, Sonny, I'm standing right here. I'll be back. I'm just going to climb way up that tower and drop a block of iron on your head. Yay. Okay, Melon, we got to line this up, bro. Let's see. You're right there. Is this far enough? One more? Um, Let me see. Let me see. Let me... I'm going to test it. I'm going to test it with some sand. Uh, is that a perfect shot? Yeah, bro, it was. It didn't do any damage. Of course it didn't do damage. It was just sand. All right, send the anvil, Sonny. Are you ready?
ready to die, Melon. I'm ready. Please work. Break the curse. Break the curse. Uh, Yo, what? Bro, I got a little helmet and it just destroyed the anvil. What the heck happened? We farmed all of those iron nuggets for nothing, bro. It just shattered on your head. Bro, wait, is this gonna get rid of my iron block? Okay, thank God. Dude, these fire helmets, these everything helmets are too OP. I'm trying to drown. I can't even go underwater. It won't let me, bro. You're right. Are you kidding? We've got flotation devices. This is so annoying. Okay, that's not gonna work. Uh, maybe the zombie. Kill me. What the heck? Melon, look. I'm juggling zombies. Wait, Sonny. I've got an idea. Melon, these guys are literally bouncing off of my dome. Check this out. Check this out, Sonny. If I get underneath the water. Okay. No, no. Stay away for a second. Yeah, that water's coming for you. There we go. No, it just broke the block above me. No. Are you kidding? Oh, wait, 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 Melon. I know what to do. I know what to do. Give me a second. Give me a second. I just gotta get a little bit of wood. I'm gonna make a trap door and I'm gonna make a water bucket and then I'm gonna help kill you, all right? Okay. This has got to work. Okay, got the water. I got the water. Now, dig your little hole. Okay, dig in my hole. Get inside. Oh, wait, you're there? No, dude, not in the water, bro. That's not gonna work. Get over here. It hole has been dug. Very good, sir. And then I need to crush. Wait, actually, get out of the hole, sorry. Get out. Get a new hole. Ugh. I know, science sometimes is slow. And now, get in the hole. Okay, I'm in the hole. And uh, let me see. Can I drown you? Is that working? Yo, it's actually working. No way. Are we that smart? Are we that ingenious? I think we outsmarted the system, Sonny. Come on, Melon. Are you gonna start taking damage? Yo, I'm gonna die. Is it working? Wait, is it? I think I'm actually gonna die. You're losing health for real? Yeah. Let me provide you with some nourishment, child. What the heck is that? Why is my dad here? Bro, it won't let me lose more than three hearts. I'm stuck. Wait, you're not dying? No, bro. When I get to three hearts, it gives me regeneration. Bro, I thought we figured it out. That was so close. God dang it. You mean gosh darn it? Gosh darn it, dude. Gosh darn it. Bro, we were so close to being smart. Wait, Melon? That gives me another idea. I have something super smart. Dig yourself another little hole. I would be right back. How many holes am I digging myself, Sonny? Actually, just come over here. I'll show you why. Wait, Santa Claus? <laughs> You've been a good kid, Sonny. Bro, how many characters are in this? Here's some cookies. Yo, I'm getting cookies from Santa. Let's go. All right, Melon, come to my house. First, let's get Santa's cookies. And second, I've got to get something out of my ender chest. What's that? Uh-huh. <laughs> You'll see. Right here is my ender chest. And uh, don't you keep 64 truffle pig spawn eggs in your ender chest? <laughs> what the heck? Why do you have truffle pig spawn eggs? Because they're my favorite animal. Oh, and here's those cookies I was promising you. Here, have some. Wait, where, where are they? They're on the ground, bro. Oh, thank you. I can't even eat these. I know you prefer it when I rub them on the ground and get them a little dirty for you. What the heck are these chests, bro? Dude, don't look at my secret loot. Leave them alone. Melon, leave my secret loot alone. Okay, I'm sorry, bro. My bad. Now come to the truffle pig paradise. Why are there so many normal pigs here? What the heck? Because these are my people. And Melon, don't go in yet, okay? Don't go in there yet. Don't. Hey, back up. Back up, dude. I want to go in. Yo, ch chill, 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 chill. Wait for it. Wait for it. You need at least 23 mobs. Okay, there are 32 pigs there. Jump in. You should start to die. All right, I'm jumping in. Are you taking damage? Is it working? No, I'm just getting pushed to the side. Nothing's happening. Spawn some more. All right, more pigs. I'll put all 64 in this hole. They should be entity cramming you. You should be taking crazy damage. Bro, I, I'm not dying at all. Uh, okay, hold that thought. I gotta get something else from my house, okay? Okay. Okay, buddy. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go back to my house and grab some TNT. This is surely gonna kill Melon. And my TNT chest. Get the flint and steel. Hey, Melon, don't move a muscle. Don't worry about it. Bro. Bro! Come on! This might actually work! Wait, what? What? Hold on, hold on. What just happened? It just broke the TNT. What? It's just replacing it. What is this? Dude, TNT doesn't work. Are you joking? Hey, light that one. Light that one. I got you, bro. Light it up. Light it up. Light it up. Bro, it won't explode. There's too many entities. And the men, the All right, get out of there, Melon. We're gonna have to rethink this. Let me out. Come on. I'm stuck. Yo, look at my pig army. Sonny, I can't get out of here. Be free, my beautiful pigs. I can't move. Let me out. Everybody knows pigs get the priority. Come on, I'm so close. Close. 
Let's go. I made it out. Bro, thank God. Sonny, your idea failed completely. What the heck? There's so many pigs now. Bro, if you don't like my ideas, why don't you come up with something, dang it? Okay, I will, Sonny. I'm gonna go grab a puffer fish, all right? What the heck happened to the town, bro? I think the aquarium leaked. The aquarium is definitely flooding, bro. And your mom is talking to you. You forgot your lunchbox at home. Make sure you eat enough today, Melon. Bro, this leak doesn't even make sense. Why is that house pouring water out? Whatever, whatever. I gotta go get some puffer fish. <laughs> Yo, how did the aquarium flood my home? I'm not questioning Minecraft. All right, give me this bucket. Where? Oh my God. Bro, there's not even any puffers. What do you mean? That's the aquarium. There should be lots of puffer fish. There's not a single puffer fish in here. In case of flooding, bailing bucket. Um, I think this floods a little big for one tiny little bucket, bro. Dude, that's all the town could afford was one bucket. Let me pick up this bucket. Just punch it, dude. What are you doing? This freaking water ring, dude. Oh my god, I can't stand this water ring. It's so annoying. Get out of there. Why is my house leaking? It's not even attached to the aquarium. Bro, there's no puffer fish in here. Yo, creeper, I'm gonna come back and use you later, but first I gotta find the puffer fish. Yo, the puffer fish got out. I need to grab this puffer fish. Come here. And then poison me. Yo, what? Come here. It just went flying. Get that puffer. What is it doing? Bro, I can't even pick him up. I think Minecraft updated and added flying fish. Puffer. Get him. Please. You can do it. Oh, I caught him. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Now come over to an isolated area and put him on my head. Okay. Okay. I think what we should do, Sonny, get in this hole. Okay. I'm in the hole. Be quick. Be quick. I'm going to be real quick. I'm going to be real quick. Yes. Wait, where's the puffer fish? He's not even in here. Wait, I think I picked him up by accident. Not feeling it today. Sorry. I'm staying in my bucket. Are you kidding me? Bro, what the heck? Hey, at least my sister brought me a little snack. <laughs> Thanks, Claire. Lol. Dang it, bro. What the heck? We can't even use puffer fish. Sonny, but I found one mob that might be able to do the trick. Okay, what is it? What is it? What is it? Follow me, follow me. In the aquarium, there's something else? Hello, Mr. Creeper. We keep our creepers in the aquarium. <laughs> what? Bro! It just teleported away. Wait, is that a creeperman or an enderman? What is going on? <laughs> a creeperman? Melon, we're finding new mobs today. First a flying fish and now the creeperman? Bro, not the creeperman. He's so spooky. Dude, I was gonna try to eat this ramen flesh, but I can't even eat food. Dang it. Our food is always saturated. That's not even fair. Melon, we're gonna have to go on an adventure. I think there's one place that could kill us. What? The nether. Yo, you're right. You're right. There might be something powerful enough to kill us there. Let's go. I know what it is, Melon. I know what it is. Come into my house first. We gotta loot all my beds and bring them to the nether to blow ourselves up. Sonny, that's actually smart, bro. <laughs> you can't put beds in the nether. I got two. You have a lot of beds here, too. Who are you having over? I know. I know. Grab them, bro. This should be enough to blow us up for sure. Let's find that nether portal now, Sonny. Melon, you got that bucket, right? Dude, I got that bucket, bro. <laughs> it's got a little puffer. Okay, good, good, good. As long as you have some water, we'll be fine. Make sure it's full of water. Let's go find ourselves some surface lava and make a nether portal. Let's go. Melon, there's cactus. Baby, we can. What the heck? Why do we have a cactus helmet now? Bro. It turns them into barriers or something. What is this? Bro, what the heck? It, but it turns out. Wait, I actually got hit by a cactus. No way. Hold on. What if you jump from the top? Oh, it did a little bit of damage, but not enough. Dang. Oh, oh my God. Hiccups. It won't work, Melon. It's not enough power. Sonny, it's not working. We've got to give up on the cactus dream. Wait, there's one thing we didn't try yet. Sonny, Sonny, get in a hole. Get in a hole. Get in a hole. I am in the hole. Yes. What? It just breaks on my head, dude. It's not going to work. No, you don't know that. You don't know that. Ready? Check this out. Yeah, good job, bro. Dang it. We need something that kills us in one hit. What could kill us in one hit, Sonny? Beds in the nether. That's going to one shot us. Hmm. You're right, Sonny. You think a lot. Thanks, bro. My brain is big. You think very little. Yes, I know you think very little, and I already found a lava. Yo, lava pool. Let's go. Okay, Ellen, can I trust you with this, or do you need to give me the water? Do you need adult supervision? Nah, bro. I got this. Okay, you put it here. Okay. Yeah, now what do I do? Just give me the water, then, if you don't know how. You go right here. Yeah. Okay, good. And then I break this. Perfect. And then you need to put the water. I can't put this. I just realized I can't drain 
in this bucket. What do you mean? I can't get the water out of the bucket. That's fine. Oh, that's not so fine, huh? But I have a lot of iron, so like, we're gonna just make a new bucket. Yeah, I'll make a fresh one. I'll make a fresh one. I'll pick up this water. Don't worry, we're gonna be good. Boom, 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 boom. And then I pick this up. Please don't be wrong. Oh, I messed it up. Oh no, Melon. Why would you do that? It doesn't go there, you idiot. It's fine, bro. It's fine. Uh, and then I go like this, this. It's gonna be okay. Look, see, I'm a genius. It's all calculated. Yeah, I'm sure it is. And then I'm gonna go like this. Everything is gonna be all right. Do, 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 do. That's how the song goes, right? And then I break these. Yeah, that's exactly how the song goes. Do, 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 do. Do, bow, 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 bow. Hurry up. Oh my God. I'm speed running here. Chill. Okay, it's done. No, it's not. What do you mean? You didn't even build the portal. Why did my water bucket fail? Okay, I'll fix it. There we go. Now we can finally break the curse. Sonny, I don't mean to bring up your big brother, the sun, but we only got 12 hours left. Look, it's setting. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, get in the nether portal, bro. We can break this curse. It's time. Let's kill our ourselves. Let's commit the die. Yo, try selecting your bed. It won't let me. Wait, what if I'm quick? What? It broke it. Melon, this is terrible news. How the heck are we supposed to break this curse? Bro, try the TNT. Just try it. Maybe the nether. Maybe the nether will work. Please, 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 please. Please. Dang it. <laughs> what about flames? We never tried flames. Kill me, pigs. I don't have any. Bro, look at their arrows. Look at this. He shoots and nothing. It just bounces off. He shot himself. What happens if I anger the pigmen? Let me punch you. I one tapped him. Oh my gosh. Melon, what has this come to? Let me hit him. It won't let me punch him. Bro, wait, I'll get him. I'll get him. <sighs> nope, I can't. Sonny, I heard a gas. Maybe they can do the job. Please. Dang it. Let me hit you. I need to die. Melon, I found another fortress. Maybe this place could kill us. Wait, where the heck are you, Sonny? I just kept running forwards. I don't know where you went. I'm going to this fortress, bro. Hey, what up, bro? I found you. Thanks, Melon. Follow me. Yo, skeletons. It'd be a real shame if you were to shoot me with those. Bro, we're actually too overpowered. This is so annoying. Oh, Sonny, there's no need to build when you can just swim in the lava. Yeah, but uh, we need to get up there, bro. Nah, bro. We need to swim in the lava. The lava won't kill you. We've been over this. You're gonna get a fire helmet. Bro, we gotta get in. Aye! And I break this and this and this and I go in. Yeah, you do that. I'm gonna go on the floor above you. There's gotta be some blazes and wither skeletons that could kill us and break the curse. Dang it. I can't figure this out, Sonny. This castle just keeps going to dead end to dead end. Ellen, we need to figure out how to do the dying. How does one do the dying? Ellen, you're going the wrong way. Clearly, it's this way. No, bro. Come on. I hear something. A little magma cube. Show me your big brothers. Oh, he's he, he's stuck on the ceiling now. Oh, and he's dead. <laughs> blaze spawners. Come on. Blaze, 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 blaze. Oh, blaze, 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 blaze. Pigs. Okay. Very good. Ha. They go flying. Great. Very epic. Very much epic, yeah. Are there no spawners here? There's gotta be at least one. Yo, there's a ghast. There's a ghast. Wait, it just despawned. No way. Bro, what the heck? Where did that marshmallow go? It's, he's just not there anymore. Oh, we needed that. There's not even a blaze spawner here. The world is so empty and abandoned. Bro, this is the most trash nether fortress ever. Melon? Melon? There's a spawner up to our right. There's a blaze spawner. Please. Yes, there's blazes. Kill me. Kill. What? Bro, us touching them kills them. Don't go too close. Don't go too close. Come like right here and just stand still. Sonny, I know there's one thing that will for sure kill us. What's that? It's the void. So what we're gonna have to do is farm up and get to the end. You're actually so smart. Or maybe the ender dragon can kill us. Yo, you might be right. There's so many things in the end that could potentially kill us. We gotta get there. Now we just need blaze rod. Yo, mutant blaze. What the hell? He's actually damaging me. Come on. Wait, maybe he could kill us. Do it. Kill me. I'm stuck in his vortex, but he's not killing me. Bruh. There's a wither skeleton here somewhere. Yo, over here, Blazes. I'm over here. He's not killing me, so I'm killing him. Bruh, the wither skeleton. I'm destroying him. I knew. Maybe these Blazes. Can you 
die, please. Oh my god. Shoot me. Bro, the fire just bounces off. That's it. I'm killing them. I need blaze rods. Sonny, I'm whacking this guy with a bone. This is gonna take forever. Do you have a sword or something? Okay, I got our first blaze rod. I got our first blaze rod. Okay, I'm gonna go craft a sword. I'll be right back. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. His little minions. Drop blaze rods. All right, sword has been crafted. Now let me just whack him. The heck? Oh my god. We need blaze rods, Melon. Hurry up. I'm trying to kill this dude. He drops so many. Here we go. He's got me stuck in a tornado. What the heck is this? Yo, yo, I got some epic loot. Yo, if you break his little things. Oh, they punch into blaze rods. You're right. Let me get these. Let me get these. Come on. How do you break them? Oh, oh my god. Just right click them. They actually hurt me. They did. Oh, but I regen too quick. Let me explode. Yo, they actually do damage. Yeah, but then you heal up so fast as it doesn't matter. Dang it. Kill this little dude. Yeah, smack him. I have seven blaze rods. Yo, I think we got enough. I got five. Yeah, we have tons, dude. We just need to get some ender pearls now. I want to keep farming them, though, because they're really satisfying. They are. I will eat these. Melon! Melon, look what we found! No way we found a bastion, too? This run's actually going so well. We need to farm their gold blocks, trade with them, and get tons of ender pearls. Let's go. And since we're invincible, we really don't have to worry about dying. I know. These guys are... Yo, they're right here! Yo! Check this out. Thanks for this block. Oh, what are you gonna do, buddy? Oh, you're dead. I didn't even touch you. Why did you kill him? We actually need to trade with these guys. Oh, that was an accident, dude. I didn't I didn't mean to. I just walked close to him and he died. Yo, like, look at this guy right here. I'll give you your gold back in exchange for ender pearls. Good deal? Yeah, it's a good deal. Yo, check this out. Diamonds. I even got a netherite brick. Yeah, I accidentally killed my guy by going too close. Oh my god, dude. Magma Cube, you're gonna die. You're gonna kill yourself. Don't hit me. I'm farming up all the gold, Melon. Yo, look at all these juicy gold and blockers. This might be too much, but I think after we farm all this, we need to find some someplace else that's more safe because they're going to die in here too easily. You think so? Oh, wait, maybe? Hold up. Maybe I can make them a little hole in the ground, right? No, no, don't come to me. Stay back. Wait, I can push them over there. In there, bro. Get the gold over there. Yes, I got one of them trading. Don't go close, Melon. You're going to get... You got him trapped. No, I got to I gotta make it so he doesn't get out of that hole. Okay, you killed him. I tried my best. That's what I was worried about. No, no, no. Look at this. Now we got a nice hole for them. Yeah, and we got to find some to bring them over here. Melon, don't go too close. I trapped a lot of piglins. Now I got to somehow, without going too close, throw them the gold. Start trading. There we go. Now back up. Let's go. Be very careful, Melon. Don't go so close. Don't go so close. Oh, I killed one by accident. It's fine. We didn't need it. We have enough. Now we just wait for the ender pearls. Be patient. I don't see any pearls yet. They'll drop those there pearls. Don't you worry, Melon. They'll give them over. Melon. They dropped some pearls. Kill them. What are you doing? What if we don't have enough? It's too late, bro. We better have enough. Come on. Come on. What is it? What is it? We got so many pearls. Don't even worry. Yo. How much gold did that guy have? Bro, we don't need gold. And take your diamond chest plate off. What are you doing? Bro, I want to make sure I don't die. Oh my gosh, Melon. You're trying to break the curse. We need to die. Oh yeah, wait. I forgot. We need to die. Uh, uh, let's get the heck out of here, Sonny. Melon, let's get out of the nether and go find the this stronghold. Please. We only have six hours until the witch deletes our Minecraft. We gotta hurry. Okay, okay. Hurry up. Hurry up. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, 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 uh. Here, blaze powder. Take it, take it, take it. Are you okay? I'll light you on fire. That might help. This should be more than enough as of in there. Now look at this stronghold. Oh, you want me to do the math? Okay, I'll, I'll triangulate. I'm doing it. Where did I go? Oh, oh, this way, this way. Run! Let's go. I can't even grab this. Okay, there we go. I am not going very quickly. Water sucks. Okay, stay on land, stay on land. Melon, the sun's even lower. It's nighttime. Throw another ender eye. Come on, come on. Same direction, Sonny. I'm gonna speed run. Just give me this. Bang! Stop throwing them. We don't need to throw more. Let's go. Melon, if you waste our eyes of ender before we get to the stronghold, I'll be very salty. Don't worry. We don't even need them, bruh. We we kind of do, actually. Actually, you're right. We, we, we do kind of need them a little bit. Melon, it's this way. We're so close. Come on. We are right on top of it. Hold on. I'm gonna go a little further, then throw one more eye of ender just to double check. Please, please, please change directions. Please go behind me. Please go behind me. Yes, it is right here. Let's go. Okay. Stop throwing them. We already know it's here, Melon. No, it's, it's been located, dude. We're good. Just 
dig down. I'm digging. Hey, and we're supposed to dig straight down. Hopefully it kills us. Yeah, you're right. The rules of Minecraft are backward. Melon, I found it. I'm busting in. Let's go. Yo, save. Let's go. Break this door. Move it. Move it. Yo, it's right here. Wait, actually? <laughs> Let's go. I'm gonna step on this spawner. Nothing. You can't touch me, Silverfish. Melon, you better have enough eyes. We got this. Please. Please, Melon. Don't troll me. That was my last one. Not now, dude. Melon! I swear. Put it on. Put it on there. What? What? Okay, I'll do it. I'll do it. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Oh, I had to troll a little bit. Okay, Sonny. What do you want to try first? Jumping in the void and crystal ender dragon. Let's see you go in the void. No, I want to clutch up. Why? Why do you want to clutch up? Void me. Please kill me. I deserve this. Come on. No. <laughs> what is this? No, Sonny. We can do it. I swear to God, we can do it. Okay. Okay. Get low enough. Yeah, that ain't gonna work. Dang it. You're right. It doesn't work. Maybe the end crystal. Come on. Melon, look into the eyes of every enderman you see. You're right. Come here, buddy. Uh, there's even a mutant enderman. Yo, look at him. Look into his soul. Yo, what you gonna do, bro? Oh, he is not doing any damage. Oh, I got hit. I actually got hit. Yo, I took half a heart. This is good. Melon, I'm gonna water bucket up. Yo, he might actually be able to kill us. Come on. Where's my water bucket? What is going on? Water bucket, go. Oh my God. Sonny, I'm actually dying. I'm actually dying, Sonny. Yo, I died. No way. No way. Dude, I was gonna use the end crystal, but it doesn't work. And the ender dragon's having technical difficulties. What does that mean? Oh my God, where am I? Am I dying? Melon, am I dying? Bro, the mutant enderman. It's the only thing in the game that can kill you. Hurry up and kill me, Enderman! Let's go! Melon, I only have one hour left in Minecraft time! Dude, kill me! Melon, he won't kill me! Sonny, you just gotta annoy him. I'm trying! I'm going to run out of time and have to delete Minecraft! Wait! I'm getting swarmed! I'm getting swarmed! Yes! Please! A little more! Just a little more! Dude, slap me! Slap me! Yes! Let's go! Let's go! Sonny, we did it. We managed to die. We did it, Melon! Even though the Ender Dragon wouldn't kill us, not even the Void could, we found the answer in our friend, the Mutant Enderman. <laughs> Let's go. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. And comment down below your ideas of how to get yourself dead in Minecraft. We did it. We beat the curse. We're free. Yes. I don't have to delete my Minecraft. Let's go. Yeah. Melon, we've been searching forever for this treasure. I thought Quandale said it was down in this cave somewhere. Yeah, he said it was somewhere around around here. Something about an awesome totem. Yeah. I think he called it the totem of revival. Maybe. That's a weird name. <gasps> but Sonny, he mentioned it was in some kind of fortress and I think we found it. This looks dangerous, Melon. Be careful. A warden could be living here anywhere. It's okay, Sonny. It's okay. Look. The chest containing the ultimate treasure. Yes. The totem of revival. Wait, what? There's nothing in here. Bro, it's just dirty old cobwebs in a skull. I'm dead. Bro, this is trash. Maybe it's somewhere deeper. I don't know, Melon. I think I look pretty cool now. <laughs> Do you like it? Sonny, that's not the treasure. We gotta keep looking. And I think I found where it could be hiding. Look at this. It's a hallway. It has some signs. The treasure is near, but beware. All who have searched... All who have searched what? What happens? This is creepy, bro. Are you sure you want to explore deeper? I think maybe we should just go home. Uh, are doomed! Ah! I don't want to be here, Melon! I'm scared! Sonny, you coward. I'll find this treasure on my own. Okay, fine. I'll help you. I won't leave you alone yet. But I swear, if there's a warden in here, I'm leaving. Sonny, it's chill. Don't worry. I've got this. Uh, this place gives me the creeps, bro. Whoa. It's infected with some kind of weird parasite. Yeah, Melon, it's called the Skulk and a Warden who's gonna eat you for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. He'll turn you into watermelon stew. Sonny, don't worry about it. There's no Warden around here. There's no summoning block. We're chill. <gasps> There's dead 
people everywhere. Bro, I don't understand how these people died. Maybe they got stuck down here without a ladder or something. Yeah, probably just starvation, not a horribly violent death against a warden. Wait, what the heck is this? There's a lever, and it looks like there's a trap door. Wait a second. I think I found the secret. No, Melon, Melon, don't go down there. I'm not going down there. <sighs> What's it like down there, bro? Oh, I found a secret room. It's filled with diamonds, a bed, and a music block. It looks like someone's been here. Okay. I still don't think I want to come down. The totem's got to be around here somewhere. <gasps> a secret trap door. Let me just get rid of this cobweb. <sighs> and it's time to enter. Wait, what happened? Where'd all my items go? The heck? And see a chest in there. What's in it? Wait, why can't I open the chest? What's happening? Oh, that's it. I'm scared up here by myself. Melon, I'm coming. Melon, Melon, where are you? Melon, where'd you go? Yo, Sonny, Sonny. Sonny, I'm right here, bro. What are you talking about? Guys, where'd Melon go? I don't like this place. It's giving me the creeps. Get me out. Get me out. Wait, no, Sonny, the loot's right there. Grab the loot. Sonny, what are you doing? Oh, no. My flashlight. It's out of batteries. I gotta go. I gotta go. Guys, why can't Sonny hear me? Wait a second. Where am I? I'm completely invisible. Ah, I gotta get out of here. This place is giving me the creeps. Wait, these were ghost blocks. What is this? Go, go, go. Ah, ah. Wait a second. Where's Melon? Where's Melon? What? I've got his head. He must have died. Melon, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bro. Wait. No, Sonny has my head. I really died. What What the heck? I'm way too young to die. I gotta see Quandale. I hope there's something he can do to help bring Melon back. Quandale, you've gotta help me. We went on that treasure hunt you told us to, and Melon died. Oh, I didn't see that. Are you holding his head? Yeah, but he won't come back to life. Normally he respawns, but I haven't been able to find him. Just died, huh? He probably ended up as a ghost, I think. I do know how to bring him back, but I don't have the items with me. You need to go get them. Okay. Quandale, where can I get those items? I gotta bring Melon back as soon as possible. Uh, first, you need to go to the Doom Tower in the Nether. You will find fiery blood and tears and also melon seeds. I need these items to help bring Melon back to life. Thank you so much, Quandale. For now, keep Melon's head safe. I'll be back. My beautiful face. No, I'll never get to see it on me again. Wait, <laughs> I'm still wearing this stupid skull? Okay, let me take that off. Whoa, the Nether Tower. This place looks crazy. I really hope I can find the coordinates I need. Come on. I've got to help Melon come back to life somehow. Sonny, don't let me down. You got to save me. Ah, uh, there needs to be something around here somewhere. I haven't found out any of the coordinates yet. Hello? Is anybody home? Uh, probably have to get to the very top of this tower. This tower goes on forever. Even as a ghost, I'm getting tired. Oh, my legs. I don't think I'm going to make it. <sighs> I'm sorry, Melon. I skipped leg day, and I'm getting too exhausted to tire. Sonny, don't you stop! Don't you give up on me already! I don't think I can do this. Sorry, Melon. I'm sorry. I gotta catch my breath. <coughs> da! Keep moving! Wait, what just hit me? Wait, I actually punched Sonny? What the heck? Go, go, go! What the heck is hitting me? Wait, maybe it's Melon in the ethereal realm as a ghost trying to speed me up. Yes, it's me, Sonny. It's me. Uh, punch me three times if that's you. <sighs> yes. One, two, three. No way! It's really you, Melon! Yes! Yes, we're able to communicate now. It looks like we can communicate through the art of violence. Well, that's not very helpful. Well, it's kind of is, Sonny. Whoa, what is this? Netherite diving armor. I think this will grant me immunity to lava. Oh, I still have this stupid skull on. What the heck? Put this on, this on. Oh, no, I need that. That's my that's my backpack. Perfect. And I need my leggings and my little boots. Whoa, this will help me swim in lava. Let's go. Come on. There's gotta be something in this tower. I just know it. Oh, there's striders in here. That is weird. I'm pretty lost right now, but one of these lava pockets has gotta be the right way. Nope, not this one. Is it this? Dang it, it's not that one either. Get out of my way, strider. I've gotta go through. Nope, it's not that either. Yes, I found it. The secret layer. What's in this chest? Y equals 91. Okay, and X equals 
nine eight seven. Okay, this is good. I just need one more coordinate. I just need the Z coordinate. It's probably down here. Yes, another chest containing the Z coordinate. All that's left to do is take these coordinates and head to the Nether. Sonny's actually doing it. We're gonna be able to find the Nether Hub. Come on, this must be the place. It looks so cool. Whoa, there's lava fountains and everything's made out of Nether bricks. Yes, the portal, the Nether Hub. Get me to the treasure. I'll save you, Melon. Whoa, what is this place? It looks like there's an obstacle course. If I can get through this parkour, I should be able to get the items necessary to save Melon. Just gotta make these jumps. Let's go. <gasps> what the heck? That was a ghost block. Wait, speaking of ghosts, Melon, if you're here, build me a way back up, please. I've got you, Sonny. Wait, guys, I could see Melon. He's building for me. Yes, thank you. Wait a second. Uh, If you can build here, why am I even doing this parkour? Why don't you just put blocks everywhere for me? Because I can't put blocks here, Sonny. But what I can do is show you which ones are ghost blocks. This one right here is a ghost block. Wait a second. I think Melon's removing the ghost blocks for me. I can do this. Yes. Is this real? Okay, it's real. We're good. We're good. Whoa, it looks like there's a magma block pattern down there that represents barrier blocks up here. I can just make these jumps now. Huh. Oh, this is scary. This is scary. You can do this, Sonny. You can do it. Hey, is this a ghost block? I hope not. Ooh. Uh-oh. This isn't good. Sonny, you must choose the right path. Guys, I don't know how to communicate this with them, but both are the right path. Oh, wait, no, this one isn't. Yes, Mel is showing me the right way. Come on, show me the way. Show me the way. Yes. <laughs> Get pranked! Get pranked! Okay, uh, maybe I shouldn't do that anymore. Melon, if you prank me again, I'm not gonna try and save you anymore. Okay, I won't prank you anymore. I won't prank you. Uh, which one's the ghosty block? Oh, thank you! I should be able to climb along these vines. Yes, I've done it! The first item. What is it? The fiery blood! Perfect! Now I just need to find the tears and melon seeds. Whoa, a warped fungus on a stick. What is this for? No way. I've got to ride a strider! Now I've just got to get over to the boy and make the job. Yes. All right, little guy. We're going to the vine. He's stuck on a leash. Hold on, Sonny. I've got you. Oh, thank you. And then I just need to get off him here and climb the vine. Yes, I'm doing it. Don't worry, Melon. I'll save you. And jump, jump, jump. Oh, this is good. This is good. Is this more barrier blocks again? It is. I'm doing a big skip for Melon. What? There was no barriers. I guess it's serves me right for trying a melon skip. Check it out, Sonny. A beautiful melon skip deserves some beautiful ladders. Oh, thanks for helping me cheat. And what's in here? The fiery tears. Perfect. All I need now is melon seeds. Jump! Just a couple more jumps and I'll save you. I'll save you, brother. Come on. Come on. Let's freaking go. This is getting scary. I'm almost out of hunger. If I run out of food, I won't be able to make these jumps. I've got to go quick. Oh no. I don't like these vines. Why do I always have to Tarzan? Oh, that was scary. Come on, Sonny. You're so close. Just got to swing along these vines a little further, a little further. I'm so close. I can save him. Yes, I'm in. The last chest, fiery blood, fiery tears. But wait, there's no watermelon seeds. Oh wait, I actually don't need those in the nether. We grow watermelons back at our house. No, Sonny. Hey, don't you dare. <laughs> Time to break a watermelon. I'm back home and all that's left to do is break one of these watermelons. Come on. No. Why is he breaking multiple? <laughs> I finally have an excuse to harvest these. No, Sonny, stop. Melon was trying to stop me too as a ghost. I could tell he was punching me. And then I just need to turn them into seeds. 21 melon seeds. Perfect. That means I have one for Quandale and 20 for the fire. What is wrong with him? I'll save you, dear melons, and I'll grow you into beautiful, juicy wanders. Hey, Quandale, I got everything you asked for. We've got the fiery blood, the fiery tears, and some watermelon seeds. All right, great work, Sonny. I will prepare the scanner. But in the meantime, Sonny, take this fiery blood and melon's head. Head to your basement where I've built an underground lab. Once there, run the program I've prepared. It should
should bring back Melon's voice, as he's been following you, I'm sure. Thanks, Quandale. I'll get right on it. And yeah, you're right. Melon's been following me everywhere. Do, 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 do. Quandale said there's a secret laboratory underneath our house. Sounds pretty cool. Hey, check this out. Shortcut. Now, where would the secret lab be? Nope, not over here. This corner? Nope. Ooh, probably in this trap door. Yeah, that looks about right. Guys, I don't know how he hasn't known about this yet. It's obviously in this corner. Yo, I think this is Melon. <laughs> He's trying to show me the way to the science lab. Oh, it's down here. <gasps> this place is crazy. Whoa. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I've got to put Melon's head right about here. Then I put the fiery tears and blood into this device. That looks about right. And then Melon, punch me once if you're here. Okay, perfect. I need you to stand right inside of this machine. Okay, yep, I can do that. No problem. Okay, I'm going to assume he's standing there. And now, if I press this button, it should bring him back to life. Did it work? Melon! Melon, I can see you! But you're still a ghost! Yo! Yo! I'm visible! Sonny, can you hear me too? Ah, uh, Guys, I can hear Melon again. You're so annoying! Yo, chill, Sonny! I've already died! Have some respect for the dead. Yeah, but I'm literally trying to bring you back to life and help you respawn and everything. And then I've got to listen to you yap all over again. Ugh, whatever. Let's go see what Quandale has to say. Sonny, we don't have time for this bickering. We only have 24 hours before I'm a ghost forever. Yeah, 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 Melon. I'm sure Quandale has the answer, though. Hey, Quandale. So your machine worked, but only halfway. He's still a ghost. But at least now we can see and hear him. Yes, that's amazing progress, you guys. Didn't say it would be easy, though. There is one final task. You need to go back to the room of legendary treasures, then defeat the warden who killed Melon, and finally retrieve the totem of revival. That's all? The dude's so powerful, he killed me once already. And you want us to go back there, Quandale? Really? Yes, but of course. Listen, I'll give you two monkey brains some more powerful weapons and armor. Hopefully, that should make you stronger. Oh, thank goodness, Melon. But why didn't you give us gear the first time? I don't know, guys. I really thought you could handle it. Well, clearly we couldn't, Quandale. Anyways, Melon, our armor's over here. Come get yourself some. Sonny, I'm a ghost. I don't need armor. Oh, well then, I'll wear enough for the both of us. I will take this chest, though. No, Melon, I need the loot that's in that chest. I'll give it to you when you're ready. I, I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. Off to the cave! Ah, uh, Melon, slow down. I'm not as fast as you. Yo, hurry up, Sonny. You uh, might need the gear now, so uh, I'll put down the chest. Thank you. What do we have here? Whoa! Fiery sword and enchanted golden apples. I'll take all of that. Thank you. Yep, I'm gonna take the sword, because maybe I could still whack the warden. Yeah, and let me see what's in this chest. Yep, still cobwebs. All right, let's go visit the warden's lair now. I'm scared. But we won't get doomed this time. We're prepared and ready. Yeah. Mel, in his secret room was down here somewhere, right? Yeah, and Sonny, I can hear him. He sounds pretty mad. <gasps> Be careful, Sonny. I'm looking at him right now. There he is. Die, warden. This is what you get for hurting my friend, Melon. Ow, ow. He does a lot of damage, bro. I need to eat this apple. Sonny, I'll help you out. I'll help you out. Hit him. Hit him. He's so strong. He's killing me through my enchanted apple. Together, we can take him out, Sonny. We've got to team up and use our powers. Yeah, I'm trying to heal. I'm trying to heal. Oh, no. I need to eat another one. Dude, he just hit me with his blast. Take him out! Oh, no. That was close. He almost killed me. It's okay, Sonny. He's got to be low. Yo! He's so crazy when he hits the laser beam. Come on! He'll heal! Die already! Yes! We actually did it, Melon. We actually did it! Oh, that was terrifying, Sonny. And I'm a ghost. And I'm your hero! Now, let's claim that treasure. Should be in here somewhere. Sonny, it's right here, bro. I found the treasure earlier, but you didn't pick it up. Wait, you're kidding. It was in this room the whole time? Yes. <laughs> The totem of revival and so many diamond blocks. Yes, yes. Not only will I be revived, but we'll be freaking rich. Yeah, this is gonna be awesome. Let's head home and buy a new house. Let's do it, Sonny. But uh, I kind of like being a ghost. Like I'm super powerful and nothing can hurt me. Yeah, I don't think so. Whoa. Wait, no, Sonny, why? Ow, the flames, they hurt. Yeah, of course they do. You're back to life, bro. It's 
kind of nice feeling pain again. I feel, I feel so alive. Here, let me give you a little more then. Ow, no, Sonny, chill. I'm gonna die again. Chill, chill, chill. Guys, make sure you like and subscribe. In today's Minecraft video, it was just a normal day that turned into a total nightmare when the whole village went crazy wanting to kill me. That's right, goats. This man deserves only death. I've got no idea why this is happening, but I won't stop until I figure out what's going on and how to undo it. You're not figuring anything out, Sonny. Get over here. Ah! Goats, quickly press the like button now so Melon snaps out of it. You're a dead man. What? Sonny? Pew! It worked. Awesome day in the mines. I got 56 diamonds. Bob is gonna be so proud of me. He better pay me well. I hope I'll be stinking rich after this one. Maybe I'll even take Melon out for a burger. Or I'll take Sunshine out on a date. We'll see, we'll see. Hey, Bobo! I got 56 diamonds right here. It was a solid day in the mines. Wow, that's a lot of diamonds. Good job. I'll give you a stack of emeralds. Let's go! Here are your diamonds. And here are your emeralds, Sonny. Thank you, Bob! Heck yeah! This day was really productive and awesome. I ought to go buy some snacks. Yeah, I'm hungry. I think I'll treat myself to some donuts. And maybe I'll get Melon a smoothie. <laughs> a watermelon smoothie. Now let's see, what snacks do I want? Raw beef? Okay, I could barbecue that up. Gummy bears! Give me these. Yeah, that's gonna be scrumptious. Nah, I'm gonna get bacon cheeseburger tomorrow. I don't want it tonight. Ground pork. Ugh, too much cooking. I just want one more snack. Epic bacon. That's perfect. Yo, Steve. How much for all this stuff here? Sonny, it's on the house, man. You have a great day. <gasps> No way, Steve, you're the best. Thank you. Oh, this is such a good day. First, I got all these emeralds. Now, Steve's even giving me free food. Hey, I wonder about Sunshine. Let me go say hi to her before I head home. Sunshine, I was working all day, and on the way home, I thought I'd stop by and say, hey, you look beautiful, darling, and I wish you a good night's sleep. Aw, Sunny Pooh, that's so cute of you. Good night. Love you. Aw, thanks, Sunshine. Also, have a gummy bear. Time to head back home. I'm feeling a bit tired. Think I'll watch a show and enjoy some epic bacon and gummy bears. Melon! What's good, brother? Yo, Sonny! I just found this brand new video game we can play. Wanna have a spin? I do. And I even got you some gummy bears and epic bacon. Yo, thanks, bro! Now, let's see. It's getting kind of late, actually, Melon. Maybe we should play tomorrow. Come on, just one game. <sighs> okay, fine. One game only. You're the best, Sonny. One hour later. <sighs> okay, Melon. We played about 10 games, and I'm pretty tired. <sighs> Off to sleep. Night night. Good night, Sonny. The following day. Sonny! We're gonna kill you. What's going on here? You scumbag! I don't love you anymore. Ah! Why are you guys all attacking me? I didn't do anything! What's going on here, Quandel Chill? Bob, you too? What is this? Something's not right. Something's not right. Yesterday, everything was fine. And all of a sudden, I wake up and the whole town wants to kill me. What is this? Get back here, Sonny! Go away, Melon! I don't know what you did, but everybody hates me this morning. <laughs> You're dead when we find you, Sonny! You're dead! Okay, this is not good. I don't know why the whole village wants to attack me. I'm gonna investigate Melanie's house. She was one of them. <sighs> what did I do? And why are they so mad? Yesterday was the perfect day, and now today is the worst day ever. But maybe I can get to the bottom of this and figure it out. There's gotta be a clue around here somewhere. Why is Melanie and everyone else going mad? Hmm. Nothing in these chests or these drawers. There's just bread in the fridge, but I'll take it. Nothing in the freezer. Hmm. Maybe upstairs there's something. No. Nothing here. Maybe in Melanie's room. Oh, there's nothing here. Maybe the computer? Dang it. I don't know the passcode. Wait a second. Why'd the TV turn on? What's this? Greetings, people of Block Village. Today we have some breaking news. Everyone wants Sunny dead. We have Steve tuning in. Steve, what do you have to say to this? Sonny is a scumbag. I hate him from every fiber of my body. He needs to be killed. And the reason being... I don't need a reason. He's dead as soon as I get my hands on him. Okay, we now have the word's most greatest and smartest scientist, Quandale Dingle. Mr. Quandale, how do you comment on this? We need to kill him as soon as possible. 
He's too dangerous to be kept alive. Okay, so everyone wants to kill Sunny, but no one knows why. Well, if Quandale says that we should kill Sunny, then folks, you heard it here first. Go and kill Sunny as soon as possible. Coming up next is Brad with sports. So no one in the town knows why they want to kill me? Are you serious? What is going on here? Uh, Melanie? What are you doing here? Get out of here, you villain. Melanie! Melanie, chill! Oh, this is bad! Everyone wants to kill me! He's here, Melon! He's here! Sonny! You're dead! No, 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 Melon! Melon, chill, bro! I don't want to have to do this to you, but if you make me, I'll beat you to death with this pickaxe! You won't do anything! You're dead, Sonny! Melon, I don't want to do this to you! Die! Oh, why am I in a pool right now? <laughs> oh, no! Oh, Melon, please! Melon, please! Uh, Sonny, do you know what I'm doing here? And why do you look so scared? Calm down! Melon, did you come back to your senses? But how? Ow! Why the heck do you hit me with your pickaxe? I'm just making sure you're the real deal. Anyways, you care to explain this whole thing? What kind of shenanigans is happening? I don't know what the shenanigans are. That's what I'm trying to figure out. I had the best day ever yesterday. I made all of these emeralds after a big day of mining. Then we played this new video game. Then I went to sleep and woke up and the whole town wants to kill me. Hmm. I don't know. Have you asked Quandale? Melon, Quandale also wants me dead. He called me a scumbag. Oh, this is really bad then. I think we should sneak into Quandale's lab. That's not a bad idea, but how exactly are we gonna do that, bro? I've got some potions back at the house. Follow me! Melon, I'm kind of nervous to go in this house. What if someone's still here? All right, I'll go in, Sonny. They want to kill you after all, not me. True. I'll just stay right up here. Oh, hey, Baba. What are you doing inside of my house right now? I'm waiting to see if that scumbag Sonny comes in. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's kill Sonny. Yeah, he's a bad guy. Do you feel that? Uh, feel what, Bob? It stinks of Sonny. I don't feel anything. You're probably just imagining things, Bob. Anyways, here, you yeah, need these. These are very important. All right, anyways, have a good day. What are you doing with those invisibility potions, Melon? Um, obviously, I'm gonna use it to sneak up and kill Sonny, of course. Melon! Melon, Psst, Melon, is everything okay? You're working with Sonny. Ah! No! Bob, chill! Chill! I got your back, Melon! Run for it! Go, go, go! Sonny, we gotta go invisible! We gotta go invisible now! Let's move it. Close the door. Phew, that was a close one. Well, Sonny, now that we're invisible, we should probably sneak up into Quandale's laboratory. Melon, you're invisible. I don't know where you are. Can you hold an emerald? Oh, yeah, I'll hold one of these gummy bears. Oh, perfect. There you are. Yeah, let's sneak into Quandale's lab and get to the bottom of this. But, Melon, what if Quandale's there? Well, Sonny, we're invisible, so we won't even be able to see us. Just put away your emerald and sneak in with me. Good point. I'm gonna eat a gummy bear, and now I'm invisible. And check it out. Quandale isn't even home. It's gonna be so easy to sneak into his lab. You're right, bro. This is gonna be light work. Uh, Melon, our invisibility just wore off. You two really think I'm that stupid? Ha ha ha. I've disabled invisibility in here. Quandale, wait, bro. You really don't think it's weird that everyone wants to kill Sonny with no reason? Yeah, Quandale. We're always working together. Don't do this, bro. Enough. Guards, kill them. Sonny, dip. Run. They're on to us. Ah! We've got to find a place to hide. And Sonny, our house is too obvious. I know the perfect place to go. Yeah, also our home is compromised. Bob is in there. Oh yeah, that too. Oh, that was close, Melon. Do you need any food? Now, Sonny, I'm thinking we hide in Stevie's mansion. It's super nice, and it's the last place they'd expect us to hide. That's right. But he's got a maximum security system, so we're gonna need to build up. If we go through the doors, we'll set off an alarm. You're right, Sonny. Build us up there. Hold up. Wait a minute. Uh, you mind moving? Oh, uh, my bad. Sonny, what are you doing? Give me a second. Hey, uh, there we go. We're in. Yes. Sneak in through his balcony. Wait, why is the TV turning on? Sonny, I've got a bad feeling about this. This just in. We have word that a guy named Melon is now Sonny's accomplice, but don't take my word for it. We have Bob here who can tell you what happened. He helped Sonny. They attacked me in their basement. I barely made it. We have to kill them, guys. You heard it here, folks. Everyone kill Sonny and Melon. Well, at least we know why we're killing Melon now. This is so stupid! Sonny, why the heck did you come down in the basement? Well, you and Bob were taking so long, I got worried. I thought I would check on you. You are an idiot! I should have just killed you when I had the chance. No, Melon! We should work together! We're brothers! If we don't combine our forces and make sure that our brains are working at maximum capacity, something really terrible could go wrong. What was that sound? Run! 
Not again, bro. Everything is going wrong. Get out of my house, you filthy traitors. What did we do to deserve this? Sonny, there's only one man I think we can go to for advice. Okay, who's that? Don Dale. We've made it. Don Dale's tower. But Melon, there's a slight problem. It looks like Sunshine's beat us to it. Sonny, you've got to go over there, sweet talker, and then smack her over the head with a pickaxe and kill her. Dude, I'm not gonna kill her. There's just something cursed with all the village folk. Plus, that's my girlfriend. Okay, well then can you at least distract her so we can get in? Yeah, yeah, I got this, I got this. Oh, Sunshine! Why don't you go crazy fast? Fangirl mode. I've got gummy bears. Ah, it worked. She's after me. Just eat the gummy bears. Just eat the gummy bears. We're going to break the curse. Sonny, I'm heading in. See ya. Well, I'm looping back around and uh, 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 close the door. Don Dale Pringleton the Wise. We have come to seek your guidance. Why do you keep looking at that bird? He's blind, Melon. Remember, he can't see. There you guys are. What the heck happened to everybody in the town? Don Dale, thank goodness. I knew you were fine. So here's the deal, Don Dale. I woke up this morning and everyone wants to kill me. We don't know why. But the thing is, Melon was able to break the curse after I killed him inside of some water. Hmm, that is strange. But I think I might know what is going on. Someone put a spell on everyone in the town and it's cursed them and made them want to kill you. But I know of the cure. That's awesome, Dondale. Tell us about the cure, please. I will, but I have bad news. What do you mean by bad news? Well, you see, water is the cure. You splashed melon in water and cured him, so it reverted him to normal. But that won't work for most people. They'll just respawn and still have murderers' intentions for you. Why is that, Dondale? Well, you are a watermelon, so you naturally have special water flowing in you. But the others will need special water as well, and I only have one sample. So, Dondale, what do we do? The only way is to attach my one sample to Quandale's machine and transmit that to the entire village. But he won't agree with that since he wants to kill you. Wait a second. I've got an idea. Dondale, give me that sample. It's in the chest. Thank you very much. What's your plan, Melon? I know a guy who can change our identities. He has an illegal uh, business, but he'll help us for sure. All we've got to do is pay him. Well, I do have a bunch of emeralds left back from when I went mining yesterday. Perfect! Let's Let's go. Uh, Melon, that looked pretty dangerous. Uh, I think I'll take the stairs. It hurt a lot. Two hours later. All right, Sonny. This guy should be in the basement. Melon! <gasps> Where the heck are we, bro? You made us travel 5,000 blocks for this? Sonny, trust me, it'll all pay off. I hope so. I'm exhausted. Do you even know how to get in the basement? To be honest, not really. Yep, this is the wrong way. I found it, Sonny. The bossment. Uh, why'd you call it the bossment? It's because there's a boss creeper who lives here? Melon, don't you know how dangerous these guys are? Yeah, but we have no choice. Well, well, well. If it isn't Melon, how are those hearts, buddy? You scammed me! For now... I have no choice, so I came back to you. How did I scam you? I literally gave you everything you want. I, I didn't know that. Anyways, I came here to trade my hearts for some money. Can we just get this over with? Okay. Step inside this room so the doctor can take the hearts from you. You will be paid immediately. All right, seems extremely sketchy, but let's do it. Right, I'm feeling sleepy. 20 minutes later. There you go. The hearts have been taken and the funds have been added to your inventory. Wait, no way. No way! I'm still Stinking rich! On top of all that, we have a mansion for you. Here are the coordinates. Oh my goodness. Goats, I've got to see what I just bought. I paid for it with my life. So it better be nice! Mm, this doesn't look all that nice. It's just a big old wall and a door. This is the most beautiful, hugest mansion I've ever seen! Oh my goodness! Whatever, whatever. I'm over it. I've got a new job for you. We need new identities. Can you do that? There's no job I can't do, Melon Boy. And who's your friend over here? My name is Sonny, and who the heck are you? I'm not gonna tell you that. You can just call me Creeper Boss for now. Okay, Melon, you know the drill. Get in the room, and the doctor will patch you guys up. All right, Sonny, this part's super sketchy. Uh, you can go first. Uh, should I pay him before or after? Don't pay him at all. Okay, good idea. I'll go first. Do, do, do. Ah, surgery time. A few minutes later. Yo, Sonny, it actually worked. Wait a second. How do I look? Bro, I'm brand new. Hold on. I want my new secret identity. Melon, it worked. How do I look? Oh, I, I don't really like my skin. Can I get a new one? No. 
That's all. Now pay up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll pay the creeper boss. We already paid your nurse. Can we dip now? Yeah, no problem. All right, let's go. Melon, do you think that was a good idea to scam the creeper boss? Oh, he scammed me before. He'll get over it. Melon, with our disguises, we should be able to get into Quandale's lab. No problemo. Yo, what's up, Quandale Dingle? Yeah, so Quandale, we heard about the problem in this town and how we need to kill Sonny and Melon. So my friend here, not Big Man Melon, he got himself this cool potion device thingy. We just need a way to transmit it, and it will lock onto their location and obliterate them. Well then, what are we waiting for? Put it in my machine ASAP. We're on it, boss. And here we go. So, uh, not Big Man Melon, you think that worked? Yeah, not Big Man Sonny. I uh, really hope so. What the heck? Who are you two? Okay, Melon, I think it worked. We can turn our skins back to normal. It was us all along, Quandale. Someone put a curse on the town where everyone wanted to kill us. So, we had to trick you into helping us save the world. Who would do such a thing? It was probably Dr. Longbottoms. Yeah, you're probably right, Quandale. But Melon, how can we put a stop to Dr. Longbottoms? Only if the viewers press that subscribe button right now. So, today in Minecraft, I'm dead? This is so awesome! Hey, you're supposed to be crying and all sad and stuff. Like the video right now if you think Sonny was always super mean to me. Yo, that's not true. Comment Sonny emojis to bring me back to life. Or melons with poop emojis if you think he's mean. Cows, I'm gonna need your milk. Cheap can you just be quiet for one second? All right, well, that's not gonna work. Oh, this job is terrible, bro. All I hear all day is the cows mooing, the sheep sheeping, and the chickens chickening. Oh. Hey, Melon. <laughs> How are you enjoying your new farmhand job? Bro, it's so boring and loud, and honestly, I really don't like it. Can we go out here where I can actually hear? Yeah, sounds good. Yeah, those animals are super loud, but I thought you loved animals. Dude, I love animals. Animals, but bro, I'm tired of taking care of them. Well, you should have invested in my real estate project because I'm living pretty good, as you can tell by the gold, diamonds, and emeralds. Dude, your idea was stupid. I have no idea how it worked. I figured I'd just live a humble life on the farm. Yeah, bro, while you were living off the fat of the land, I was getting rich! Yeah! The investments have paid off, and now I run this town. Everybody reports to me, and I control the town. Taxes. Speaking of which, uh, you know how taxes are normally 10% per week? Yeah. Uh, I'm going to increase that to 70%. Uh, cough it up. 70% taxes? There's no way I'm paying that, bro. No one in this town is going to pay that, bro. We're going to revolt against you. Yeah, I wouldn't be so sure. Everyone else has been paying their taxes according to the new regime, and it's time to give me all your milk. All right, well, I, I only have three milk buckets, so you can take two, I guess. Put it in the shulker box. Put it in the tax box. Okay, yep, I got you. Yep, hold on. On the tax box. Don't worry. You are a criminal. It's fine. It's only your first offense. I'll let it slide! Because <laughs> I'm so rich. Now I'm gonna go tax everyone else. Hello there, Alex. Yeah, it's tax time. You know, the greatest time of the week. And yeah, I'll be taking your diamond helmet off your hands. And I'm thinking I could use some new boots. Yeah. We'll call it even on the 70%. Pleasure doing business. Oh, I look good. Oh, gross. The chicken just pooped all over me. <laughs> Yo, Melon, if you want a new job, I could probably use a little lawn care service over at my mansion. You know what, Sonny? If it's tax-free, I'll do it. Uh, yeah, it's tax-free. Yes. All right. Deal's a deal. Hey, guys, I'm going to pay him less than minimum wage. Ah, uh, yes. What a privilege it is for you to be working on my estate. So please start carving up all the grass. I don't need these weeds here. Yep, I got you. I got you. I'll arrange your payment, okay? Let me just work on that. Yes, guys, tax-free money is the best money. Okay, Melon, are you done cutting my grass yet? No, Sonny, dude. It doesn't take just two seconds. Chill. It's a time thing. All right, well, I'm gonna give you your cash payment in advance because I just don't feel like checking in on you. So you could collect that milk bucket when you're done. That's it? Just one milk bucket? Yeah. Isn't that generous? Bro, this whole lawn should be like five emeralds at least. Well, 
Maybe if you put your back into it, I'll reconsider the offer. My mansion is beautiful. That's it. I'm just not gonna cut his lawn anymore. Whoa, this place is insane, Sonny. Mind if I come in? Yes, you're welcome to take a tour of my mansion. As long as you prepare me lunch, okay? There should be some food in the fridge. All right, well, I want tax repayment for this lunch. Yep, and one more milk bucket. Got it. Uh, yep, I'll prepare a cheeseburger for you. Don't worry. Hold on. Here you go, Sonny. Where you at? Where you at? I'm upstairs. I'm about to take a nap. I'm pretty tired. I've been working so hard. Here's your bacon cheeseburger. Oh, thank you, Melon. I'll just store it here for when I wake up. Mmm, yes. All right, Sonny. I guess I'll let you take your midday nap while the rest of us are working, like hardworking civilians we are, and you're only taxing us 70%, which is, like, really cruel, and you probably shouldn't be doing that. I know. I've been really exhausting myself taxing so many people. I'm pretty tired. Good night. All right, guys. Come to think of it, it is getting pretty late. I guess I guess I'll go sleep in my barn, in the chicken coop, covered in poop. <sighs> Good morning, world. That's another beautiful day in Minecraft. Just gonna go on my balcony and enjoy the views. <sighs> Look at those peasants over there. All right, guys, time to go clip Sonny's lawn again. Make him some breakfast. Ah, yes, a beautiful day to observe the peasants at work. Hey, good morning, Melon. I guess he's just really focused <laughs> on trimming my lawn. It's a little rude. Uh, I say good morning, Melon. Man, I hope I get paid more than one milk bucket this time. Oh, I guess he's just super in the zone. Ah, I'll go back to relaxing. Time to go collect my pay. Hey, let's go. Well, I'm at it. Let me just grab a little snack fridge. Thank you very much. Sonny, hey, Sonny. Sonny, hey, Sonny. What the heck happened to Sonny? Bro, he's actually dead. Oh, 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 who's gonna pay me? Who did this? Who could have possibly killed Sonny? What's this ruckus melons going on about? Bro, I'm fine. I'm right here. What the heck? How am I dead? I just woke up this morning. I had a nice cheeseburger. Everything was cool. And all of a sudden, I'm a ghost. Oh, no. Not like this. Melon, can you hear me? Hello? Guys, I've got to figure out who killed Sonny. I don't know how this happened. I'm going to have to follow Melon around and see what we can find out. There's got to be some kind of clues around this house. Uh, let me think here. Sonny raised the taxes by 70%. That gives a motive for the murder. Who would be the most upset by this tax raise? Maybe Bob the Miner! I've got to check this out. Bob, I know you probably maybe had something to do with this. Hey guys, Melon's gonna go around town and investigate everyone and that's not a bad idea. After all, I might have made an enemy or two by raising the taxes so much. I just gotta stay right behind him, and maybe we'll gather enough information to find out who killed me. Ah, yes, Bob's minds. Oh, I just felt a weird chill go through my body. Must be Bob doing something sussy. Uh, guys, I just ran through Melon's body, and I think I gave him some chills. Hello, Bob, holding dynamite, I see. What are you using that dynamite for? Potentially murdering somebody? Melon, that is the dumbest question I've ever heard. If he used the dynamite, there'd be an explosion and it'd be pretty obvious that it was Bob. <sighs> huh? What do you mean? Who got murdered? Is everything okay? Why are you freaking out? Sonny was murdered last night and I just find it quite suspicious that you have a murder weapon on you. Well, I use this dynamite for the mines. It's how we get the ores mined down here. Way more effective than a pickaxe. Okay, yeah, that actually does make sense. I see an explosion here and you are a miner. Okay, okay. Well, what do you think about Sonny raising the taxes by 70%? Yes, finally Melon's asking a good question. I'm certainly not a fan of the tax hike, but I would never kill anyone over that. Okay, very fair. What is your friendship with Sonny? Are you mortal enemies? No, no, it was pretty neutral. We never talked much. Although I did see him a few days ago and he complained about someone stealing cake and milk from his fridge. Milk and cake? 
mistake, huh? That gives me an idea. We'll see you later, Bob. Quite suspiciously, we have a dairy store here. Owned by none other than Sonny himself. Hey, Steve. So how do you feel about the taxes being raised by 70%? Hey, come on, Steve. Admit it. You know you loved it. I was pretty shocked by it, but I've always been fond of Sonny until a few days ago. What happened a few days ago? Oh, I remember that now. Someone did put poop and melon seeds all over my house. Wait. Steve, you're still holding the poop. I'm so sorry for you. You shouldn't have to go through that. Maybe Sonny kind of deserved what happened to him. Wait, what? No, I didn't. That's it. I'm giving Melon chills. I'm run through his body until he's frozen. I'm feeling a little chilly right now. Ooh. All right. Thank you for your information, Steve. I'm going to go interview the next suspect. Guys, I'm not going to lie. I'm highly suspicious of Steve. He has a crazy motive for wanting to kill Sonny. He's literally holding my poop that Sonny made him pick up. That's insane. Wait, did Melon just say it was his? Is poop? Guys, this is sus. I don't know what's going on here. I thought Melon was the investigator, but he's pretty suspicious himself. Well, let me interview the last person on my list. Alex's armor shop. Alex, did you kill Sonny? What? Me killing Sonny? No, I love that guy. He was one of my most favorite and consistent customers. I liked him as a person and he bought most of my armor. Why would I kill him? We always had a good laugh together and he always brought me plenty of money. So what if he raised the taxes? Hmm, you seem to have a good relationship with Sonny. Perhaps too good of a relationship. Sonny and I were talking the other day, and he was complaining about his movie disc getting stolen. And come to think of it, Melon, I was working a late night shift, and I saw you going to Sonny's house really late at night. So if anyone is being suspicious, it's you. Are you trying to accuse me of killing Sonny? I know I didn't kill him, okay? I didn't. I couldn't have because I don't remember it. Alex, you're being way too defensive. You probably <laughs> killed Sonny in cold blood, and now we're trying to blame the crime on me. That's it. We'll see what the police think of you, huh? Huh? Uh, guys, I think this is just getting out of hand here. Melon's accusing everyone of the crime. But the real question is, who took my movie discs? I was gonna watch those. Guys, I forgot about one last person. The Quandale Dingleberryton himself. Quandale! No, Melon can't be serious. There's no way Quandale could be the killer. He's too awesome. Quandale, so why did you murder Sonny? He didn't, Melon. He's Quandale. He would never do that. Why on earth would I kill Sonny? I know you two longer than anyone else. We worked together. We hung out together. You bought stuff from me. I always helped you. You always helped me. It doesn't make sense for me to kill Sonny. And no, it doesn't bother me that Sonny put the taxes at 70%. Because as you probably guessed, I have more business than just this stupid shop. So this is not my main source of income. Therefore, I have no reason to be upset. All right, Quandale, you actually make a really good point. Hmm, what's that? I know Sonny's mansion is super sick and has all this fancy security. It should have a security camera room somewhere. Oh my god, how could I forget? Okay, I've got to check his mansion now. There's got to be security footage somewhere. Oh, yeah, that's true. I forgot I installed those cameras. Uh, it's over here. Where's this footage? Uh, where would the room be containing all of the footage? <gasps> Maybe in this gigantic movie theater room. Probably in here? Wait, these are the movie discs Alex was talking about. Frozen, SpongeBob, the movie, and Minecrafty in the movie. These are all my favorite discs. What a weird coincidence. Oh, yeah. Oh, that hits the spot. Oh, beautiful. Dude, what is that? There's a blood trail leading to the kitchen. And it's the burger I made for Sonny. This, dude, this is actually really gross. I'm gonna get rid of this. Wait, is Melon cleaning up the crime scene? He's removing my blood. Uh, what is this? Wait, he's at least found my security room. Whoa. What is this place? Camera monitor. Whoa. I can look at these tapes. This is gonna tell me who killed Sonny. Yes. Yes. Okay, goats. Why don't you comment your predictions right now? Who do you think killed me? Was it Steve, Quandale, Bob, Alex, or Melon? Okay, we'll start with 6 out of 16 and play the footage. Wait, why is that me? I'm stealing Sonny's cake and I'm drinking his milk? I don't remember this at all. This has to be faulty. What the heck? Well, he kind of deserves it for only paying me milk. Let's check out this next camera. 6 out of 17. 
see. And boom! Yo, I'm gonna check out this video with Melon. That's disgusting! Why is Melon pooing all over my house? Uh, I kind of remember doing this, but I thought it was just a dream. <laughs> Still deserved, though. He deserved that poop everywhere. All right, all right. Six out of 18. I'm getting a little worried here, though. I'm not gonna lie. What? I don't remember doing this at all. Bro, what is going on? I have a really bad feeling about this. This last camera monitor might reveal something I'm not ready for. Ah! Wait, you've got to be kidding me. Melon was sleepwalking and killed me. What? I can't believe I do it. There's no way I do it. I killed Sunny. That's it. I'm gonna get my revenge. Guys, I forgot. God, I sleepwalk on a full moon. It must have been all the built-up anger from Sonny raising taxes and underpaying me and just being not a good person. Well, I guess he kind of deserved it. Wait, Melon saying I deserved it? The guy literally killed me in my sleep and in his sleep. That is so ridiculous. That's it. I'm gonna figure out a way to get revenge. There's gotta be a creeper around here somewhere that I can possess. Come on. Come on. Guys, I don't wanna sleep in the chicken coop again. Oh, wait. No one's living at Sonny's mansion. I might as well just make it my home. No way! Mel is gonna break into my mansion and sleep in my bed? He killed me! And then he's stealing my house! Do, 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 do. Look, guys! A creeper! I've just gotta figure out a way to possess this mob, and then I'll be able to get my revenge on Melon. Come on! Come on! Yes! Yes! It worked! I'm a creeper! And now I've just gotta sneak back into my own mansion and detonate melon <laughs> Are you kidding? He's already asleep? I can hear his snoring from out here. He's got a problem, and I have the solution. <laughs> he thinks he can kill me in my sleep and take my house? Wait, what the heck is he doing? He's sleeping inside of my bed, and he even left my head here? This guy is weird. That's it. He's gotta go. And say goodbye to your watermelon! Oh, what the heck just happened? Wait, why is there a creeper? my room! Die! <laughs> Tss, melon. Tss, you're dead now, dude. What do you mean I'm dead? Welcome to the shadow realm. Sonny, how could you? Well, you killed me first, bro. Well, I mean, I didn't really technically kill you. It was unintentional. I was sleepwalking. And also, you definitely deserved it. Just like the viewers deserve to like and subscribe.